Start your summer road trip at Midas and get up to $30 off your next repair service. Plus, get a free closer look vehicle check to make sure you're road trip ready. If you need brake service and alignment check or tune-up, hit up Midas for up to $30 off. For more details, request your appointment at Midas.com. Ash, Lutzi and Susie O'Neill, the best bits. Um, when we had our family Mother's Day dinner the other night, uh, my daughter Alex came up with a really beautiful idea, I thought. She, um, grandma, her grandma, Cliff's mum, um, passed away at the end of last year and she used to write a lot of postcards and letters to Alex and Alex said, I want to get a tattoo of <gasps> gra- what? <laughs> grandma, like grandma signing off her oh, cards, like saying grandma kiss kiss or just the G kiss kiss. Isn't that okay. beautiful? I've mm. heard of people doing that. Like family, getting family members writing or kids writing. Someone's had a doodle. Kids write it. No, not a doodle. A kids. Wouldn't have used that word. Um, <laughs> scribble. Scribble. As a tattoo. Yeah, I've seen kids scribbles as tattoos oh. on people. I've seen um, like uh, parents will get their kids with the uh, like a handprint of the when hand they're print. born. Oh yeah, that's not a bad idea because it's the actual size. Mm. See, I always wanted to do that. That was my grand plan, but I couldn't get my like Harrison's hand to stay still. He'd always like claw his hand up, so we never were able to get a good imprint of his little newborn hand. Mm. So you've, deviate. You've, you've got their names, haven't you? I've got their... So I, I, I got designed a little silhouette of a little boy and a little girl who represent my son and my daughter holding hands, and it's like black and white. Is it mm. actually them? Uh, like, it's designed off, so, like, the, uh, well, because Matilda was, like, three months old when I got it tattooed on me, but the little boy looks like Harrison, and it's kind of, like, what we think Matilda will grow into. Mm. So, yeah. That's You're cute. Okay. Um, I thought that was a good idea, but she came up Are with you, it. You don't mind about mm? tattoos on your kids? Doesn't really worry me. Well, because well, she came up with another idea. My mum wouldn't be like, wouldn't like that. Your mum? Yeah. Well, because it was grandma related, and I thought it had a yeah, good, you like know, it's it. not, she's not getting a bumblebee or a... But I'm trying to think. Of, Where's she going to get it done on her body? Is it visible? I'm not sure about that one. But right. she also had another idea for a family tattoo. Like all get the same. Because you remember Cliff had the idea of our 25th wedding anniversary getting a tattoo, which we uh, didn't and probably aren't. But the family one was good. And we're like, what's something that br- reminds us of each other? Oh, geez. Like expensive marble. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be the most <laughs> thing that resonates with all of you. <laughs> You're very funny, but it's not expensive. No, not no. Six car garage. <laughs> and all the six car garage. Oh no! All of, all, yes. all of you Ash, together in, in the lift in your house. <laughs> Okay. Like just mid floor. Yeah. Between the <laughs> third and fourth yeah. floor. Yeah, it's no. going to really bond you together. <laughs> no, none of those, but thank okay. you all for chipping in with that. That was oh. very funny. Well, the way you do, you guys talk, you should, you should, should mm. get a bloody... We're going again, are we? Bloody, no, this is serious. You guys should just get your credit cards on, on, on their arms. You are so okay. they can just No, no, I mean, it's means because they, they spend all your money, those kids. No. No. You know very what I'm funny. saying? No. Ash, wait, Ash talks. A, 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 a silhouette of you guys all sitting in business class. <laughs> <laughs> So far from the truth. Just hashtag oh, grateful. No. no, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> business class seat. Hashtag turn left. <laughs> oh, hashtag God. Always you got turn no left. idea. It's so far from the truth. <laughs> yeah. No. Okay, finish with the jokes. Oh, the real thing geez. is a mango because <laughs> we grew up, the, tr- the house we grew up with. Um, had a mango tree in the backyard. We were there for 20 years. Like, it's the... the <laughs> what, don't... It's the, it's the house we grew up in. It reminds me of... Please come in with a mango tattoo. <laughs> Please. We are just, <laughs> A little mango oh, tattoo. Chest. No, get a big one, mate. Get that <laughs> like, full size. And like we're going actual... to... I think Alex is going to get that one on her ribs. On her ribs. So we're going to get... Like, so yeah, there, right. Yeah, right. You, we're going to get a little mango tattoo mm. with a, a little um, a stalk and a little leaf. Yeah. It'll remind us oh, of... Oh, that's you can help with that. And <laughs> just a map to the private jet terminal at <laughs> Brisbane Airport, maybe. Ash, Lutzi and Susie O'Neill. The best bits. Some of the things you have to do for your husband, honestly. Um, I used to work Careful, for him... 24. I used to work for him last year as his bookkeeper. I, I did that for about... Oh, sorry. 20 years. I quit that last year. Uh, which has been good. It's actually really improved our relationship now that he's not my boss. They were kind of on equal, equal footing. Has it? Oh. Equal footing again. Yes, it has. But he used to say things to you which were work related, which angered you. 
Yes, he did. I remember what he said to you years ago. That I, was when I used to iron his shirt. Remember that one? Can I mention that one? <laughs> well, it's, you it's can. Not, not even Cliff's fault. Not even Cliff's fault. I used to iron his shirt. Not even Cliff's fault. What do you mean? How is it not his fault? Because it was just a passing comment. Oh, no, Cliff is not. What are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? So this was a comment, right? This is how I. This is, this okay, is, so this I used is to story iron his tell. business shirts out of the goodness of my heart. Yeah, so he just his one wife. day, one day. <laughs> And this was the work. It's, it's a work thing because it's like you were working for him. This is what I'm talking about. Yes, right? thank so, you, Lutzi. But this wasn't Su- the book works. Though. No, Susan. In this my is pre- in oh, my mind, same time. In my mind, this is the story. You're not far f- done after swimming. Say on top of the world, Olympic champion. You know. <laughs> oh my god! Perfect. Everyone loves Susie. Everyone loves, <laughs> uh, everyone loves Susie. Everyone loves Susie. The whole nation loves her. And uh, in my mind, okay, paraphrasing. Don't, just let me sell it. It's weeks later, maybe a couple months later. She's ironing. <laughs> She's ironing Cliff's shirt, yeah. and Cliff walks past. You know, just nonchalantly walks past. Probably a cheese jaffle in his mouth. Yeah. Looks across and goes, "Hey, you're you're putting the crease in the wrong area." And some of my patients are noticing. Keeps walking. Yes, mm. just that's so, it. That's, just so that's, you that's know, the story. Yeah, it was just so you know, wasn't it? It was but, just. A, it was yeah. just him. Like, oh, just yeah. you know the thing. In the, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, it, it wasn't was, like you're I, ironing my shirt the wrong no. way. You silly. You know, it wasn't. No, that no, 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 no. And it, it was, was just a passing comment, but. You've told me that story probably twenty times. Yeah, I've, I've heard it. I've heard it as <laughs> and well. And it's obviously yeah. something which sticks to your brain. It was, the, it was the fall from grace. It was a passing comment, and that's when I realised I was now yes, I was normal again. I was normal. <laughs> was the cheese, was, was the <laughs> cheese <laughs> jaffle really there? Or no, was there was it, no, no cheese no, jaffle. I, I, I threw and it in. wasn't the crease <laughs> down the side of my shirt. It was actually the. The collar. Oh, the collar. And no, I remember it was so the yes. collar. So that's Chinese whispers. Because I was that's ironing it in the yeah. wrong spot, he it was aging it and it was getting properly. noticed. Away. Anyway, so what did I do to solve that problem? Got an Threw the iron at him. <laughs> no, I stopped what you, ironing. Stopped ironing. Yeah. I stopped yeah. ironing. But, you know, we've passed that. I've, I've got my, my yeah, anger's gone just, from that just, one. We're yeah. over that one. Yeah. Yeah. We're over that one. Yeah. I mean, I went to a lot of therapy about that. I got over that one. I did his bookkeeping for 20 years. Yep. I quit that last year through therapy. That was a big moment for me. I hope he's not listening to this. He's at work. He listens to the podcast. He listens to the podcast. Cliff, you know I love you. Yeah, we're not blaming Cliff. It's just what happens in relationships. Yeah, it does. You get stuck in the roles that you're not good at. Exactly. And then you just can't get out of them until you quit them. But last night, or yesterday afternoon, because you know Cliff famously does not own a computer, has never owned a computer. Yeah, he's still old school book. He's old school. He does all his, um, all his works written, filing, hand Filing written. cabinets. Filing yeah. cabinets. And he, so if he has to use a computer, he borrows my laptop. That's right. Or he borrows me to write his emails. And this makes Cliff sound so outdated. Yeah. Yes, he is. Old school. Mm. But he's doing a big presentation. It's coming up in a couple of weeks. 600 people, like massive He's got to do a big, big, big presentation. He wants a PowerPoint presentation with videos and pictures and everything. Yep. So who ha- who is now doing the PowerPoint presentation for him? You. Yes. <laughs> Let me take so- a guess. <laughs> <laughs> so we start. Uh, Are you, you good guys- at that? No. No, you're not good at that. You've got no. two kids. Yeah. Why don't they do it? Well, he did ask the kids. He right. asked the kids and they said, yes, yes, we'll help you out. And this is how it started. Yesterday afternoon he rings Alex, our daughter, who's 20, lives at university, and said, Alex, what time have you got on the weekend? Because I've got this massive presentation. I'm quite nervous about it. I really wanted to do a good presentation. <laughs> this is Alex in return. Not a good weekend for me, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I've got... I've got Because uh, I'm 19 years uh, old. Sunday, <laughs> I'm going out Friday night. Um, Sunday, I've got rowing all day. And mm. Saturday, I've got a massive assignment due. Yeah. And as soon as I heard that, I, she's got an assignment due. I said, oh, well, she's got to do a homework okay. i'll help you and i've just got a new computer i got it delivered yesterday in fact a beautiful yeah. dell that's nice and i said to cliff oh, i can help you with your powerpoint <laughs> and dumb mistake <laughs> no, we started yesterday we don't yeah. know how to do it i'm going oh, yeah, to the, would you you wouldn't know how to do it we're going to the tech we i'm going to the nova tech department <laughs> after the show oh, to get what are the chances <laughs> luke the queues in his car now going <laughs> i'm going to get lumbered with bloody cliffs <laughs> Powerpoint like, presentation. PowerPoint. Yes. I know. I don't know how to do it. Yeah. How would you? I like don't know. How do people learn how to do Excel, Word, PowerPoint, all the things that bypass YouTube. me? I bet you there'd be a YouTube clip. How yeah. to do it. YouTube but, but talk still, you through it. It's, it's baby steps. Like you're gonna, He's going to get up there doing this magnificent presentation because he knows what he's talking about and it's going to be stick figures on the bloody <laughs> screen. It's going to look like an idiot. Alicia, when are you free to come over to <laughs> Susan's house and uh, help Cliff out with this assignment of his? Huh? No. No. It's no from Alicia. Hmm? 
No, it'll be good. I love you, Cliff. I feel like I totally bagged in that last <laughs> 10 minutes. Did you, I, Lutzi? You, you did a bit. Did I? <laughs> is Luke McHugh calling? Is that Luke? Can we get... Pick is that Luke, Luke McHugh? Yeah, he's, he's probably he's turning around to the, exclamation the, mark. the transmitter <laughs> side. Yeah, come on. Was he's it been around. Was it Luke, he's our IT was, expert. Was, it, was I pretty accurate there, Lukey? Pretty listening? accurate. But we're closed today. Sorry, Sue. <laughs> <laughs> Lutzi and Susie O'Neill, the best bits. My um, uh, family chat group, you know, just with the five of us, my mm-hmm. three kids and Jode, it's called the Bazza Beings. That's our, I don't know how that name came about, but that's what we're called, the Bazza Beings. That's, you know, so if anyone wants to share something with the family, it just goes the to that. The Baz Beings. The Bazza Beings. 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 Yeah. B-A-Z-A? B-A-Z-Z-A. I, I couldn't tell you why. But that's what it is, the Bazza Beans. Bazza Beans. Yeah, the Bazza Beans. And uh, anyway, it was lit up yesterday because... How's it called the gene pool? Is it? <laughs> yeah, anyway, uh-huh. keep going. Uh, because of the swimming connection? Or? I don't know why. Because oh. we were genetically related. Were you genetically... Okay, right. <laughs> gene. Were your sister and... No, 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 my uh, my new family. Catherine, though, aren't it? No, Catherine's not no, my sister. Just a... My new one, Alex and Bill and Cliff. Yeah. <laughs> You're not one. genetically related to Cliff. Anyway. Yeah, that's, a, that's true. I actually. didn't understand that either. Oh, right. Yeah, that's actually incorrect. Yeah, because it'll be illegal, incorrect. wouldn't it? Yeah. Well, it's oh, frowned upon. I need to revisit anyway, okay. it. Yeah. It's, enough, <laughs> it's enough frowned of, upon. Enough of that. Back to you. Yeah, family. when you started it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't ask what it was called. You, you came out and said it, and then you explained why. Yeah, don't worry. Um, but anyway, it was lit up yesterday because... Oh, we're not related. It, no. <laughs> just to clarify. <laughs> okay, right. Hmm? Um, mm-hmm. uh, Sid's in Sydney, and he found... Uh, he found, he goes, what is this? And he sent through a YouTube clip of me back when I was hosting a game show on the ABC. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Called Head to Head. Like, I've never seen is this. Is that online? Back, back in, two, well, he, he found it yesterday. and, it, and We need I, to see this video. We need to see yeah. it, yeah. And I've gone, I've gone, oh, that was a game show that I hosted in 2006. And he couldn't believe it. Apparently, I've never told, none of them <laughs> knew that I ever did that. And then I was telling him, and he was like, It was oh. like a national TV show. It was pretty big. It was pretty big, was yeah. It on, it was like 50 odd episodes or what something. What was it called? Head to Head. What was it on? Was it on ABC? ABC. Yeah. Okay. It was on like Saturday afternoons. It only lasted one season. Hmm. And uh, anyway, I was telling him the whole story about it, and he was in stitches because, like, he had no idea. And my hair looked ridiculous. You know? Was it curly? <laughs> yeah, it was curly, and they made me wear a suit, and it was all uncomfortable. And I'd never done television like that before, mm. but I was telling him how um, I said oh, I had yeah. to audition for the show, and they'd fly me down, and I was up against, like, all these people to get the job. Mm. And for some reason, I was, like, super confident when I was auditioning, and then the the night that we shot the first episode <laughs> of the show, mm. they shot like three episodes a night and then we'd come back the next night and shoot another three episodes, which would effectively be like six weeks of the show and mm. then I'd go back down another week later or two weeks later and do the exact same thing. Yeah. And as the, year, as the year went on, I, I felt more confident in it. But at, <laughs> at the start, I said to Sid, I said, you know, like, I had, I think, the worst start that you could possibly have That's w- right. when you're doing something like that because uh, they had a, they had a packed audience there um, for the for the first night for the opening episode, mm-hmm. and even though it wasn't live, it was as shot live, as if it. it was live. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they had right. a voiceover guy, and they go, "Welcome to Head to Head, where we're trying to yes, try to find Australia's greatest sporting mind." Mm-hmm. Please welcome your host, Ashley Bradnam. And they had me in this suit, thank you. And I had to you run. Jog out, right? Because it's a sporting thing. I had to jog. <laughs> I had to jog out, and then I had to jog or, or go up like three steps mm-hmm. to a, to a platform where I would, uh, you know, the auto queue was there, and I had to welcome everyone to the show, introduce the competitors, and all the rest of it. Three steps I had to negotiate. And I tripped. Oh no! I tripped as I was going up the stairs on the very first, <laughs> on the very first show. Five seconds into my television career as a as a game show host, and you took a fall, didn't you? You like, uh, didn't just trip. I, I tripped on the on the step, and I I face planted. Like it wasn't just face planted. It wasn't just like That's I tripped and I and I stumbled. I I tripped and I smashed my face onto the the floor and I was so embarrassed that immediately you know you jump up as if yeah, nothing, you get hurt. but 
it hurt so much that my eyes were watering. Like my <laughs> my, 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 my eyes just started started watering, and my nose was was gone, and I was so humiliated. And everyone just said, <laughs> everyone just said, "Yeah, cut, cut. <laughs> we have to go again." And I said to Sid, I said, "If uh, social media." Mm. was around back in 2006 the way that it is today that would that have been exist. one of those viral things yeah, that um, sure. that just would have you know look at this jobber from the ABC <laughs> who's just completely splattered himself but I had to go backstage I had to they had to get all the makeup and all the rest of the fix my nose up <laughs> and my confidence my confidence but at that point, it didn't exist. It oh, was, it went down straight from that. I, I, I said to Sid, I said, like the only thing I was ever good at at school was I could get up and talk. Like it wouldn't, it would never bother me. But I do remember in primary school that I would hop up and I'd shake and I'd quiver if I had to do a presentation. And in that mo- in that oh, moment, no. that returned to me. Mm. That, 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 that was what I did. As oh, the, no. as that, that's the confidence that I went on with. I was so <laughs> humiliated. In it. How did it go? What's that? Oh, it was a train wreck. Oh. It was a. There was a train wreck. The first, if you, if you were to find the first three yes, episodes, we will. we're going to put it on in, yes. uh, Instagram. Yeah. Ashlot's Instagram. So it's yeah, actually yeah. on Instagram. Well, uh, no, well, the it's episodes. On YouTube, I think. Sid found it oh, on YouTube. YouTube. Yeah, 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 I've got, I've got what Sid sent, sent me. Yeah. Nick's behind you, not all Nick, and he's putting up. Showing us photos of you. Yeah, I found one things. of you bunny hopping up onto the stage. A, a lot better entry this time. <laughs> yeah, you well, bunny hopped. Yeah, well, yeah, but that would have been later on in the series. So I don't think. I, I think mm. they've buried the one. Your confidence I, is up here. Yeah. Okay. All right. Find one where he doesn't look confident. Yeah. We'll find, put that one up. See if you can find <laughs> the fir- If you were to find the first episode of Head to Head, there's no way. He didn't go to air. The fall. The fall didn't. No. No. But, but the could, first episode. You get a didn't. sense of the lack of confidence. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ash, Lutzi and Susie O'Neill. The best bits. Ashley Stars and Stripes mattress sale is going on now. For a limited time, save $500 on select Temper Breeze mattresses or save $400 on select Stearns and Foster mattresses. Plus, get up to five years special financing on select in-store purchases made with your Ashley Advantage Synchrony credit card. Hurry to your local Ashley store in North Charleston and Mount Pleasant for the best 4th of July mattress deals only at Ashley. Subject to credit approval. Minimum monthly payments required. Minimum purchase required. See store for details.